Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we're talking about iPhones and more specifically, I'm going to answer a question I've been getting a lot lately. And that is how do you update your credit card for the autofill on your iPhone? So let's go ahead and talk about that. First off guys, this is gonna be a really quick video. There's actually not a lot of steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video. But why would you wanna update the credit card that shows up when autofill is used on your iPhone? Well, that's pretty easy. The most recent versions of iPhone have an autofill feature, and that way you can store a credit card number, expiration date, and three digit security code. And that way, when you are purchasing something through Safari using your iPhone, it'll automatically pull that information up and auto populate it or autofill it. But if you change credit cards or you wanna use a different credit card, this is how you can update the credit card in your autofill. It's all handled here in the iPhone settings tab. It's this gray wheel looking thing. I'm gonna go ahead and open it now. Okay guys, I went ahead and opened up the settings tab on my iPhone. And if you'd like to update the credit card for your autofill feature on your iPhone, what you wanna do is scroll down until you get to Safari. So I'm gonna scroll down and this is what we're looking for. It looks like it has a blue compass next to it. I'm gonna click there now. Okay guys, I went ahead and clicked there and now you are in the Safari settings tab. And if you'd like to update the credit card that's used for the iPhone autofill feature, you wanna go ahead and click right here on this line called autofill. I'm gonna click there now. Okay guys, I went ahead and clicked there. Now I am in the autofill settings for my iPhone when I'm using Safari. And if you'd like to update the credit card that's used for your autofill feature on your iPhone, you wanna go ahead and make sure this line is green and that way your credit cards autofill features turned on on your iPhone. Next right here, you wanna go ahead and click for saved credit cards. I'm gonna click there now. Okay guys, I went ahead and clicked there. As you can see, I do not have any credit cards currently in my autofill feature on my iPhone. If you wanna go ahead and add one, just go ahead and click add credit card. I'm gonna add one now. Next, you wanna put in the cardholder name, 16 digit card number, expiration date, and you can put a description of which card you're gonna be using. So if it's your cash app or your Venmo or something like that. So I'm gonna enter all that information in off screen now. Okay guys, I went ahead and entered in all of the required information and then I clicked the blue done button. Now you can see I have a new credit card here in the autofill feature on my iPhone. And if you'd like to go ahead and delete or change, you can just add another credit card here or you can click edit. Okay, I clicked edit. I'm gonna go ahead and click the little bubble next to it. Okay, I went ahead and clicked it. And then you can go ahead and delete the card if you would like to. So there you have it guys. If you're wondering how to update the credit card associated with the autofill on your iPhone, that's how you can do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. But hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel. And I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.